James Lee with James Lee's Bees here. Been a hot minute since I've done any real bee work. I'm at the office yard or the Reliance yard and uh, checking out some of the colonies that have been at various stages or whatnot and um, finally getting a chance to do some washes and check out what the mite situation is. This is a queen bee from Corey Stevens VSH stock. They washed four mites. Look really good. They had a real slow start at the beginning of the season. Um, after coming back mated, she had a real slow, small colony to work with and was able to build it up to the three mediums you see there, three medium, five frames. Uh, this one here is a swarm that was retrieved from, I can't even remember now, I want to say uh, Saline, Michigan, a Wagner Road school swarm that was retrieved and uh, these guys here were a very early swarm from a beekeeper who uh, couldn't retrieve them from the tree and what's interesting is is that the the colony here um, is showing very high VSH characteristics lots of uncapping very strong brood pattern lots of resources I even pulled off uh, two honey supers off of there um, and there's still plenty of honey in there and the Goldenrod flow is jamming right now, so I expect them to backfill pretty easily. Um, I moved some of the honey frames and extra from here over to a colony that earlier in the year had not successfully requeened. And so I gave them a frame. I can't remember without checking records, but it's this box here. Um, gave them a frame of brood and they made a queen. Took a while, uh, but they were able to successfully requeen. Looks like there's a pretty strong brood pattern in there. They are doing exceptionally well, exceptionally well. Um, and I gave them a full honey super. Now these ones here, I'm really afraid to take apart to be honest with you because they both have been kicking butt. This is another queen from Corey Stevens. Um, it's just brimming with honey and stores. And uh, the same with this one here. Uh, that's another swarm trap colony. That's a Romulus swarm, probably some of my bees. And uh, these are yet to be examined, but we're going to go through them today and do some checks, see if we need to do any man manipulations. But I'm, I'm remiss. I'm not really going to be doing too much, to be honest with you. Um, I don't have a lot of equipment to really be doing any splits or modifications. So these bee colonies are pretty much going to be uh, what they are. Um, if they are in the process of requeening or they are in the process of uh, being queenless, I might replace them if they're queenless. But otherwise, I'm not going to do a whole lot besides combine and condense. Um, this one here, I'm going to check out, see how they're doing, and give them a super full of honey and call it good. Well, so that's it for now. Ta ta.